coach were here at media day today. Um, there's a lot of um, talk going around about how be a, us being picked last. Um, talk about you know how the team's going to view that and just what you're going to use with that in practice. You know, we really don't think it's that big of a deal. Uh, we're going to prepare the same way we would if we were picked first. Um, you know, we focus on how to win basketball games, not where we're picked at in the preseason. Um, we, we may use it today to motivate guys a little bit, to get their attention, but um, we're just going to go about our business like we have the last three weeks. One returner, we've only got two guys with even a couple of minutes of experience in D1 uh, basketball. Talk about uh, the hurdles that the team's going to have to jump through very early on. we got a tough non-conference schedule right out of the gate. Yeah, inexperience will probably be our biggest hurdle, but there's only one fix for that, and that's to gain some experience through playing in the games. Uh, we prepare with high intense practices. Um, we do a lot of um, non-negotiable work, meaning there's only one way to do it, whether that's on offense or defense, in hopes of preparing them to play at the speed and with the physicality of a Division I program, and in hopes that that would help their lack of experience. But at the end of the day, this group's going to have to get out there against a tougher opponent and get it figured out on their own, and then hopefully bring that back to the practice field and translate that into to, to harder, more physical, faster practices. Coach, we have a very diverse roster, a lot of guys from a lot around the country and even a couple from outside the country. Talk about the strength that we have um, with that diversity. Yeah, you know, I think that it, it shows these guys what real life is about, how you're going to meet people from different avenues of life that can help you reach your goals. And what we try to do is we try to recruit where we have alumni base. And so we've been able to go all across the country, even across the world, and, and grab a couple players. So we just want the best players we can possibly get, and we'll go anywhere to get them. All right, Garth, thank you. Thanks.